This is Jan Chosen Bays, and I'd like to introduce you to one of my favorite mindful eating practices. It's called One Bite at a Time, or Put Down That Utensil. So this is how you do it. You start to eat, and whatever utensil you're using, a fork or a spoon, you take one bite, and after you've put that bite in your mouth, you put the utensil down, and you take your hand away from it. And then you close your eyes, and you savor that bite. Now, if you're in company, you don't have to close your eyes, but when you're by yourself, try it. Close your eyes, bring your full attention to your mouth, and then as you chew, notice changes in temperature, texture, flavor, and then swallow. And once you've swallowed, then and only then can you pick up your utensil again and take another bite. And then put your utensil down. And here at the monastery, we actually put our utensil down facing away with the handle facing away. And that's because if anybody who was hungry came before us, we would offer it, offer it to them. So you take your second bite and you put down your utensil. And then if you're in company, you can keep your eyes open, but bring your awareness to your mouth. Savor, notice changes, swallow, and then the next bite. So the thing to notice uh, as you're doing this is various ways of cheating. <laughs> this is basically a practice having to do with impatience. And impatience is my lifelong lesson, so this can be a very challenging exercise for me. I've done it for years now, and I'm, I've gotten much better at it. But there are various things that I know notice my hand doing, uh, kind of automatically. If my mind wanders off what I'm doing, then my hand will reach in and start to get another bite, or um, it will put another bite in before I finish swallowing, or I'll rush to swallow so I can put the next bite in. All kinds of things you'll notice as you're doing this practice of one bite at a time. The opposite of this, the mindless way we eat, if we're not doing one bite at a time, is called layering. And with layering, you put one bite in, you chew for a little while, maybe two chews, and then you put another bite in on top of that. So then you have two layers, and then you chew both of them, and then you put another bite in on top of that. So often you'll discover, oh, I've got two or three layers in there that I'm processing, and that's actually interesting to discover. And, and then to figure out how does my mouth uh, manage all of that? How does it decide when to swallow? And what are its criteria for when it's okay to swallow? And how does it sort out the bite that I put in last and the bite that I put in first, which is already partly chewed? So that itself can become uh, a subject of investigation rather than uh, letting the inner critic inv invade and say, oh, you stupid idiot, you did it wrong. You just continue your investigation. Oh, I forgot. I put in three layers. Now what's going on in my mouth? So mindful eating is all about curiosity and investigation and discoveries. So please try one bite at a time and see what you discover.